So I've been wanting to do some sort of video showing off parts of my wardrobe, so I thought it would be fun to do a sort of clothing try-on and unboxing. Got some new stuff from ThreadUp, or new to me since it's all secondhand. I think I got six new dresses here. We can just kind of go through them. I bought a pink and blue and white and I guess an orangish. Lots of different colors going on, you know, pink, blue, and white. I feel like that's something, you know, that means something to trans people. Well, this one is a fun dress. I feel like it doesn't exactly fit the way I want it to around like my chest, but kind of pretty. I might keep this one. I actually really like this one. I feel like this one actually fits a lot better than I was expecting it to. It's very like, I feel like it's pretty form fitting, but it's a little flowy at the bottom. So it's like, Perfect. Definitely keeping this one. Love my lawn dresses. If, you know, you've never noticed that before. And then next we had a black and white dress. Because, you know, I like anything and everything that's black and white. I actually really like how this one turned out as well. And I feel like it's got a decent plunge. And, you know, I can show off the girls and... It's black and white, my favorite. I like the patterns, it fits well. It's nice and long, it's perfect. Oh yes, another black and white dress. This is actually a dress that I used to own that I may have worn a long time ago in an old, older video, but it kind of beat up and torn up over time. And then they had like another another one on the website. I'm like, I have to buy it. This one I expected to fit because I used to have the same exact dress, I think the same size, um, but it got beat up and stained and kind of, kind of fucked up over time because it's actually one of the dresses that I've owned the longest. I've had it, the first one I probably got originally in like 2015 or 2016. So it's nice to find the, so it's nice to find the same dress, one of my favorite dresses find a new and updated version of it for me. Bought a blue dress, sleeveless dress. Um, see how that one turns out? That should be kind of pretty. Well, that's kind of a fun dress. I feel like, you know, I could wear it up on my shoulders or kind of down on my shoulders a little bit. Definitely a little short for me, but that's okay. It's still kind of pretty. And last one, shocker, we have a, another black and white dress. God, this looks very similar to that first black and white one I pulled out, but here we go. Well, and here you have it, folks. This is the last dress for today's video. I feel like all these dresses fit me pretty well. You know, it's always, I think the biggest difficulty is finding a dress that you know, is actually long enough for me. I always just go straight for the maxi dresses and hope for the best because a lot of maxi dresses are still too short for somebody who's six foot five. I am pleased with all the purchases I made this time. And I do have one more dress coming in the mail, but that probably just won't make it into any videos or I'll just wear it as like a normal outfit during one of my future videos. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. You got to see a little snippet of new additions to my wardrobe. Maybe one day I'll go through like a lot more of my existing wardrobe. I mean, you've seen bits and pieces of it over the last couple of years. But it's kind of nice to do another thread hop haul. I only did this once before, like, God, probably two or three years ago now. Or, yeah, probably like two, two and a half years ago I did it. It was pretty soon, I think, after I moved here originally. With all that being said, I'd love to hear your thoughts. What do you think of these six dresses that I bought? Any of that you particularly love, kind of neutral on? even ones that you would absolutely never wear, let me know down in the comments below. And if there's other places other than Thread Up that you think somebody like myself or anybody who's watching might want to go to buy some clothes, let me know. And if you're interested in seeing any future videos like this, definitely put that in the comments below as well. And as always, Tipsy and I love you all and hope you're staying safe and sound. If you have not done so already, please be sure to give this a huge thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and notification bell. I love you all. Bye for now.